Peace survivors and thrivers. In this video I'm going to be talking about the narcissistic stare. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. If you are interested in one-on-one -on -one coaching, you can email me at narcsfivercoaching at gmail.com. The Narcissistic Stare A trait you may commonly notice with narcissists is how they stare at you like a scientist studying a test sub subject. It is very predatory, like an animal targeting its prey. Narcissists operate like any predator in the animal kingdom. They stalk their prey, observe any vulnerabilities or weaknesses and then exploit them. When the narcissist is staring at you, they are studying you. They are seeking to control or exploit you in some way. They want to influence or direct your behavior or your course of events. They want to make full use of and derive benefit from you in a way that may be considered unfair or dis disfavorable to you. They are analyzing your facial expressions, especially your mouth area, and trying to figure out what you are thinking or feeling. Narcissists lack empathy, so they have difficulty sensing or feeling your emotions. For them to know how you feel, they have to read your mouth area or listen to the tone of your voice. They will be trying to read your thoughts and feelings and then judging you because of them. When you see the narcissist staring at you, you are witnessing the real person beneath the mask. The vulnerable, fearful, jealous, bitter person who feels deeply threatened by you. The stare can be a, an attempt to intimidate and regain their dominance over you. It can be a subtle form of communication where they are telling you to stop what you are doing and submit to them. If you are doing something the narcissist doesn't want you to be doing, they will be staring at you because they want you to stop. They want you to remain compliant to the rules and regulations of their world. You could be eating a meal or talking to someone. Most often it will be a situation that is providing you with some form of interaction or stimulation. They hate to see you involved in anything outside of them or outside of their influence. They are pathologically envious and jealous. They cannot get the same fulfillment from those things as you can. They lack emotional arousal and emotional reactivity to other people. So they do not get the same level of satisfaction or stimulation as you do. Your pleasure is their pain as it triggers them to reflect on how they cannot get the same fulfillment as you can. Because of this, 
they will stare you down as though they want you to stop. Your pleasure is their pain. It reminds them that they cannot experience life in the way that you do. It reminds them of how miserable and dissatisfied they are. The narcissist will also stare at you during an argument or after they have done something to hurt you. They have to read your emotions to see if it's getting to you. They need that emotional reaction so they can obtain narcissistic supply. When a narcissist is staring at you, it will either provoke fear, guilt, or shame, or it could, be, it could become sexually provocative. Narcissists can obtain narcissistic narcissi supply from provoking negative emotions within you, but also from arousing you sexually. If you break eye contact, or if they can see that they are getting to you, the narcissistic stare will often be followed by the narcissistic smirk. This is where the narcissist is deriving pleasure or even sexual gratification from your pain, suffering or humiliation. The narcissist will stare at you because they are targeting you. They are seeking something from you which they want to exploit. They are studying you so they can calculate how they are going to dominate or control you. They are so filled with envy and hatred that they will spend most of their time figuring out how they are going to limit or restrict you. I hope this is enough information on the narcissistic stare. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at narcsfivercoaching at gmail.com. We have a private Reddit community where survivors and thrivers can share their experiences and knowledge. If you are interested in being a part of this community, you can sign up for our Patreon page. The link is in the video description. Check out the Narcs5 merchandise store where you can purchase your own Narcs5 t-shirt or mug. We have a variety of des designs and it is a great way to support the channel. The link to our Narcs5 merchandise store is in the video description. Thank you for watching.